Monkey. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the first review of 2022. We're here. You're here. Welcome to Vape Pip. You're here with me, Mr. B. And, and, and I think, yeah, Griff wants to come say hello. Hi, son. He's getting bigger now, isn't he? So, yeah, we're here to do the first review of 2022. And today we're looking at the long awaited review of the Rockford Project. Get it right. Get it right. There we go. Midnight Oil. Now, this is a weird one because everybody knows I hate coffee liquids. The reason being is, as a coffee connoisseur, and yes, Harley, I do have to explain this because it's part of it. As, as a coffee connoisseur, um, coffee is something that I am very, very used to and obviously understand the flavour of. The problem is, is when you're used to um, high quality coffees, anything that isn't high quality coffee, you taste instantly and it's not nice. It tastes like wee cold coffee filter. So that's why I don't like coffee vapes. So in Rockford Project, but this one out, I was like, ooh. ooh, this could be the first one I really don't like. Because I love the Rockford Project liquids. Now this, to give you an idea of the coffee flavors, is meant to be coffee with a hint of, so like a coffee latte with a hint of caramel. So let's see how this bit, shall we? Now I've got this, this is the Dead Rabbit 3 on top of the awesome Dovepaw MV, M2V23, R2D2 thing. Save your neck. So, well, I've already freshly wicked this and primed it. I'm just going to put a little bit more in just for good measure. We'll see how this vape, shall we? Oh, daddy, a lot of you know uh, uh, know what I'm going to say, because I've been saying it for a couple of weeks now. This is an amazingly gorgeous flavour. It has elements which you wouldn't expect. The, the horrible, nasty coffee flavour isn't there at all. Um, it, I'd, I'd steeped it for a week when I got it, and that got rid of any sort of bitter or sour notes. What this has, however, because of the... The caramel in there it almost takes it to a nice you know those nice biscuits those little thin biscuits that like have a hint of caramel in them um you'll be slightly flavored it, it has that sort of taste to it the nice biscuit um it's very creamy very it's not overly sweet but it is sweet It's almost like a coffee liqueur without the harshness of the alcohol, if that makes sense. Imagine Bailey's along those lines, but without the alcohol. This for me, and, and I say this wholeheartedly, this for me is the nicest coffee hinted bit, because the coffee's not prevalent. It's not in your face coffee. It's like a hint of coffee, like a Bailey's liqueur. But this for me is the nicest coffee vape I have ever, ever tasted. It is phenomenal. Ah, oh, do I suggest you go out and buy this? Well, you can get it from the Rockford Project's own website. And if you if you like creamy vapes and you want to try a coffee vape, I would 100% recommend this. If you have a sweet tooth and you like the coffee liqueurs like a Bailey's, I would certainly recommend this. If you absolutely hate coffee and refuse to try it, I would still recommend this. I don't, I don't know which, which way to go. It's, it surprised me. It's everything I wanted it to be and hoped it would be. It is fantastic. So there you go, that is my review of the Rockford Project Midnight Oil. <laughs> I don't know why they called it Midnight Oil. It's a bit of a weird one. I'd love to see them make a minted version of this. You know, like um, when you have an after eight mint with a coffee at a restaurant. That's what I'd love it to go that flavour. I think that would be wonderful. But 
Time will tell. Rochford are whacking and zaning. And yes, he does like to make whacking and zany flavours. And, and this one has certainly worked. I will be getting a lot more of this in the months to come. So, with that being said, I'm now going to do the next liquid review. I've got four reviews that I'm making over the next couple of days. I'm going to make them on, get them all out. So, it's all been quick fashion. Uh, it's unusual for me, I know. But we're getting there. I just want to say thank you for listening. Thank you for watching. If you do want to see more, you want to get on that 2022 positivity hype train, hit the like button and hit that subscribe. Until next time, thank you for watching. Monkey.